Free coffee, coffee on cruise, much appreciated. Uh, would you suggest never entering the industry and only freelance? Is it possible to freelance without corporate experience, tips and advice? Short answer is you can freelance without corporate experience. I freelanced, when I sold out of my first business, the uh, aforementioned fish business and chemicals and stuff, um, I had no corporate experience. And I just went straight into freelance. But I had very valuable uh, real world experience building, building websites that actually were used to acquire clients. Um, so yeah, you can go to freelancing without corporate experience. What I guide people to do in the mentoring program is A, you have them learn the fundamentals so that they have a good understanding of, of coding, not just the languages, but how to be a pro developer. Then we have them build a uh, demo website your showcase website, Stefan Mischuk, here's my site. And then three, on the strength of that, I have people who go out, they go out and they do two to three small freelance projects. If you have to, you do for free. You know, little jobs will take you a week, three, four days to do. Why do you do that? Because A, you're flexing your skills. Here's another user, universal principle. Practical skills are a hundred times, practical experience rather, a hundred times more viable in terms of conceptual understanding and ultimately developing skill sets than theoretical. You don't want to get caught in tutorial hell constantly doing tutorials. You want to get into the game. That's why I don't believe in code uh, combat and uh, all these, these gimmicky things. No, once you know your fundamentals, you built your basic site, then you go out there and you do two to three small little projects for real clients. Why? Because a big part of the success in a project is being able to communicate with your client or your coworkers or your boss and be able to extract requirements and figure out what they want and then execute on it and deliver something. So you do two to three like that to develop those skills. So it's like getting a fighter. Okay, you know your basics, let's get in the ring. When I learned how to box, that's how the coach worked. Once we learned our basics, how to step, how to stand, how to, how to throw punches, in the ring with spark. Right, and that's how we re we really learned quickly. Same thing. So I get them. So step one, fundamentals. Step two, build your demo website. Number three, do two to three small little projects for free if you have to. Again, you run them like real projects. And this, in, in doing that, you also learn how to time yourself. You learn how to gauge how much it costs uh, to build site X versus site Y. And then once you have those three components in place, you have a nice portfolio site. You have a few, pro two to three projects, real projects that you've done. On the strength of that, your chances of landing a job will shoot up thousand percent. Real life projects that you can demonstrate you've done for real third parties, small business, nonprofit organization, are worth much more than 50 tutorials that you've done from YouTube or whatever, right, or Udemy. Real world is where, where, where is where it is at. So that's what we do in the mentoring program. We, we provide the whole, everything you need, boom, 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 the guidance, you know, you got the support, we got the coaching sessions, etc. So that's what you would do on your own. Learn your basics, build your site, do two to three projects, then you're ready to go. Um, yeah, so that's answered the freelance. Let me go back up. We'll see what we got going on here with the questions. Uh, Stefan, would you consider yourself a doomsday prepper? No, but I, I assume that problems can happen. So I never live on the razor's edge. I did that when I was younger. Now I always have lots of buffers. I got investments in real estate. I got investments in private, uh, uh, private placements. I got investments in the market. I got investments in a lot of cash. I got, you know... So I got multiple income streams, the studio web business, now I'm doing other things, and I got the mentoring and other things as well. So it's like, it's good to be diversified. Uh, it's a good, good way to protect yourself. But do I have like cans of beans and so forth? No, I don't. 